everybody. Welcome to another edition of Mission Moment with Sherry Cooper. Hey, I'm Sherry Cooper, and today I have the pleasure of speaking with Kathy Church. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Sherry. Kathy is the Miracle Clubhouse coordinator. Kathy, can you tell everybody what is Miracle Clubhouse? What is Miracle Clubhouse? Um, so Miracle Clubhouse is first and foremost a community for adults living with mental illness. Uh, we are a workplace uh, for individuals with mental illness um, and we help people uh, reach their goals and reach their potential um, after being diagnosed with a, with a mental illness. We um, operate what we call a work order day. Uh, we have the opportunity to work together with members and staff to run the club, uh, the front desk, we cook lunch. Um, every day in our large commercial kitchen, we have a snack bar, computers for employment help and, and resumes and, and helping people get back into education and schooling. Um, and the idea is that, that we run the club together and that helps people pre prevent isolation and get back into the workforce. Wow, that sounds like a very cool program. Question, what is the qualification for one who wants to join your club? Sure, so Miracle Clubhouse is open to anybody um, with a mental illness, um, any adult with a mental illness age 18 years of age and older. Okay. Yep, we have a one page referral form um, that, that you can fill out. Usually a therapist or case managers refer their clients over, and so we receive that. <laughs> we did a lot of talking today, but this is such a cool place. I want to take a look around. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. I can show you around a little bit. Well, follow us. We're going to take a look around. Okay, so so Sherry, our clubhouse, um, like I mentioned, is run by members and staff together. Yes. This is our large conference room where we have unit meetings um, to help plan the day. So every morning and every afternoon, um, we sit down as a, as a team, as a, as a group here, and we um, plan the day. It can be what's going on that day, what announcements, um, anybody have any updates in employment or education. Okay. And then we also have what we call a needs board. And um, it's an opportunity for us to, to go through what we need to do to run our clubhouse. We always wanna reach out to our members who we haven't seen for a while, who uh, might be isolating or in the hospital. So we do a lot of cards and a lot of phone calls. So that's where we do this information. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, and here's another conference room um, where we have meetings, we have computers available for members um, to get help with employment, to get help with schooling, anything like that. And I see you got fishes back here. We do, we do. We have an amazing fish tank, um, which is always fun. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. Education room for um, members who need some quiet space to read or to write papers. Okay. So we can do that in here. Um, on the wall here, you see that there are maps of clubhouses. I mentioned that it's a worldwide program. There are clubhouses all over the United States, all over the world. So it's really neat to put it in perspective. That Boy, and quite new, uh, new Mexico. Yes. Yes. And then um, the map behind us there is the world. So it's just it's just neat to think that yeah we're here in Dayton, Ohio, but we're part of this bigger, um, bigger worldwide phenomenon of Clubhouse International. Mm -hmm. um, here's our um, small conference room where we do orientation of new members, um, have small meetings if someone needs to make a phone call. Um, people can do it in there. And we'll come around this way, and this is our front desk. So a lot of different club members here. Um, so the front desk here is where members sign in and sign out. Um, usually a member's working at the front desk, answers the phone. You kind of see there's lots of hustle and bustle going around. This is our snack bar. <laughs> this is our snack bar. And so it's a place to gather throughout the day. We sell snacks and coffee. Most everything is um, at, um, we sell to work what it costs, so we break even. But it's an opportunity to um, build skills and work together and um, run the club. 
And there's Q and Kenny. Hello. <laughs> A goodwill Easter sales. Hello to everyone from the Miracle House. Yeah. And this is our dining room. We serve uh, every day at noon. We serve restaurant style. So it gives us an opportunity to sit down um, like we're at a restaurant and enjoy ourselves. Today we had um, bratwurst and homemade uh, cucumber and tomato salad from our garden. Yeah, it was great. Yeah. yeah. And so members and chefs plan the meals, put the meals together in the kitchen, and then take turns serving. So if you want to head over this way, we can take a peek into the dining room. Or pass the dining room to the kitchen, rather. Yeah. And this is our kitchen. And this is Brad. He's doing good. Hey! <laughs> hey! God bless you all. Good to have you come out. We love you guys. So, yeah, here is everybody just cleaning up after your own lunch today. Now tomorrow we want y'all to have lunch with us. Right? Anytime. We also have um, a utility room, so we have the opportunity to, to wash our um, aprons and towels for lunch. And then lockers for our members. Now we're going to head out to our garden. What do you have here? We have so many things right here in our garden. Um, lots of tomatoes and peppers, um, cucumbers, um, lots of different spices, basil and oregano, and uh, lots of flowers. Just so many things. Um, today, I mentioned at lunch, we had a cucumber tomato salad. It was delicious, and we came out and picked it straight here. Yeah. Well, Cynthia, uh, well, thank you for the tour. Yeah. It was so much fun. And thank you for joining me. And remember, that's why you shop and donate. Because you change lives when you help the world eat your food. At the Miracle Party House, it happens so many people. So I will see you on another edition of Mission Monday. Bye. Bye.